Uh, what's up, YouTube? How you guys doing today? It's your boy Brian Parsons here representing vaultnutrition.com. I am talking about how to build huge arms. That's my subject today. Um, I get asked this you know, quite often, even though I don't consider myself to have huge arms, but uh, it seems to come up. Uh, so uh, I'm gonna see if I can help some people. Uh, my starting point, I wanna go back, uh, you know, two years after high school, uh, I graduated and I weighed 151 pounds, I believe. Somewhere in that range, around 150, 140 pounds. Uh, I basically bulked myself all the way up to uh, about 240, give or take, and dropped a little bit back down to about 230, give or take, right now. But uh, I remember struggling with uh, gaining weight in general, gaining size, and uh, you know, my focus always was having huge fucking arms, you know? I think that's pretty much all guys focus besides abs is uh, huge fucking arms. So, uh, you know, I struggled with that for probably the first uh, seven years. You know, it took me 10 years total to get from that, you know, 150 to, you know, 240. So you figure, you know, uh, to grow, you know, for seven years time, you know, I didn't make very much progress as far as gaining arm size. Um, you know, and, and one of the things that I want to bring up, I have about what five points that I want to bring up for arms. Uh, you know, I started incorporating drop sets uh, and supersets. That helped tremendously. Uh, but the biggest thing that it took me uh, quite a while to, to get forced in my head was, you know, it's not about the weight. It really isn't about the total amount of weight. You know, why the, the weight is relevant, but the contraction and the pump and the stretch, uh, making the muscle do the work is the most important factor, you know? And uh, when I started incorporating high reps, you know, that's when I started getting, you know, great results. It's always just been about heavy, 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 you know? And uh, I mean, I made small gains. I was fucking strong, but I couldn't get any kind of size. Um, so the high rep training for me was exceptionally helpful, you know, and also, uh, you know, higher volume training also, you know, seemed to help me personally. So, uh, you know, the supersets, drop sets work great, but also in collaboration with high repetition, you know, 12 to 15 reps, you know, or more depending, um, gave me the best results. Um, I also train arms twice a week now. I used to only train arms once a week. And for me, what it is, since I'll have a, a back day, back and bicep day, you know, I figure I train bicep also at the end of my workout on back day. When I have a chest and tricep day, you know, I train my triceps you know, at the end of the workout as a special group. And then on towards the end of the week, you know, Friday, Saturday, I'll train my arms alone, separately. You know, so I'm kind of breaking it up and in, in, in getting a twice a week training uh, for my arms. Uh, and I feel like that's the best way to uh, go about doing that. You know, obviously, you know, your food intake is very relevant. You know, you need to be taking enough calories to support the growth. That's pretty obvious. So make sure you eat your protein calories, you know, plenty of carbs. And, uh, you know, focus on your triceps. That's another big one too. Your triceps are extremely important. A lot of people leave that out. They want to train their biceps endlessly. But your triceps, like they said, is two thirds of your arm. So focus on your tricep, you know, um, and uh, try to focus on uh, learning your body. You know, that's the best thing in, in, in fitness overall. Learn what works best for you. You know, write things down, track them and see what happens, you know. But my best piece of advice would be, you know, train your arms twice a week, you know, split it up. You know, so you give yourself time to grow, you know, feed yourself appropriately, you know, plenty of protein, carbs and calories. And, uh, switch yourself you know out of the mental mode this is the most important factor get yourself out of that mode where you know i need to lift as heavy as possible you know focus on making that muscle fucking burn and hurt you know stretching and getting a good contraction pump and working yourself in that 12 15 rep range that's when you're going to see yourself start to grow gain the size 
you know, and it took, I think it took everybody a little while to figure that out, but, uh, you know, just focus on that, give that a try, and uh, hopefully that works for you. Uh, like I said, my name is Brian Parsons. I'm with VaultNutrition.com. Check me out. Uh, like, share, comment, subscribe if you like this content, and uh, hopefully this helps you out. I'm out.